Here's an overview of how you can integrate continuous deployment on a WordPress website using Bitbucket pipelines, the Git FTP open source deployment tool, and the WP Sync DB WordPress plugin. To start, I created an EC2 instance and installed and configured an Nginx web server, including PHP and MySQL. I also set up a fresh WordPress website and put it under version control on Bitbucket. Continuous deployment is managed through Bitbucket pipelines. Configured using a file called bitbucketpipelines.yml. When I push changes to the master branch, the specified scripts are executed in sequence. File and folder uploads to the FTP server are handled by an open source deployment tool called Git FTP. To demonstrate, I downloaded the live website to my local machine. I'll now make a minor change to the wp-config.php file and push it to the master branch. Next, we'll go to the Bitbucket Pipelines dashboard to monitor the deployment process. Once the deployment succeeds, we can check the live website to ensure the changes were deployed successfully. And it looks like they were. For database and media uploads, we'll use a free WordPress plugin called WP Sync DB. On my local machine, I'll edit the content of the About page and click Update. Once that's done, navigate to the Migrate DB plugin settings under Tools and select the Push option to push the changes to the live website. Before proceeding, we'll need the connection info, including the site URL and secret key from the live website. This information can be found on the Settings tab of the Migrate DB plugin settings screen. After obtaining the connection info, click the Connect button. Once the connection is successful, Scroll down and click the Migrate DB button and wait for the migration to complete. Afterward, let's verify that the About page on the live website has been updated, and it looks like it has. Now let's do the reverse. Update the About page content on the live website and pull it to our local machine. On our local machine, select the Pull option instead of Push, then click the Migrate DB button. Finally, if we check the About page on our local machine, we can see that the content has been successfully updated. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe for more videos like this.